Would you like to go outside? Okay. I'll bring your water out for you in a second. And I'll bring you some hay when I feed the lambs. Good morning, Patty. How are you? Huh? Well, these guys are going to be a little bit cranky this morning. They're not getting fed. It's breakup day. Boys are going to go back into their pen. And the girls are all going to go out back. group I'll have to feed in the mornings and at nights. big they're getting already. Probably time to start incubating some more. So we have a couple things we need to do today. Uh, need to pull the rams out, put them back in the ram field. Pull these ewes out, send them back out back. Uh, I gotta haul hay for these lambs and the lambs at the house. And then we cross our fingers and hope it doesn't rain. They've got a 40% chance of rain today. And with that hay that I have down, I'm really hoping it doesn't rain. And I'm really hoping it doesn't rain because I'd like to get that other field done Let's see, I think I turned the water off last Tuesday, so I'm hoping I can get it swathed tomorrow, or at least opened up tomorrow, and then spend all day Friday swathing. Hopefully. And then this weekend, depending on how much stacking he has going on, um, I would like to get these boys gone. Uh, there's not a sale, so... Some of them will have to stay, but the ones that need to, the ones that we have that are already sold that need to go to their new home, we need to get them separated out and uh, take them to their new home. And then I think we're going to try and bring some of those used homes from over at Skip's uh, and maybe just leave the ram lambs over there. I'm not really sure how we're going to do that yet, but that's kind of the tentative plan for the next couple days. Uh, we'll see how it all works out. Right now, we're just hoping no rain. It was, they said it's only supposed to get 83 today, uh, but at 10 o'clock it was already 80 degrees, and it's just muggy. Um, so there is a possibility that it could rain, so we'll see. Hey, little girl. We need to get you caught, and your brother. You guys have both been kind of wandering. The first thing I want to do is get these rams out. So I'm going to go set everything up, shut gates, open gates as needed to get them through here and out there. Well, I changed my mind a little bit. I was going to feed after I moved those sheep, but I think I need those lambs on the other side of the pen so that they don't interfere with the ewes when they come by. Uh, just for safety's sake and my own peace of mind. So I'm going to go ahead and haul some hay and feed those lambs right now. Then once I get these guys, I'll, I will haul hay to the house.
Okay. One project done. Let's go get the boys moved. Uh, and that'll be just one more thing out of the way for today. Dude, you make it easy for me to catch you? Good boy. I know, I'm on the wrong side of the fence, but... Yeah. There's my little boy. Okay, let's get you to the gate. Okay, one done. And I got his harness off. So let's see if we can get the other three without it being a big old production. out and I put all the ewes into one pen. Uh, I, I need to find a place in my barn where I can set my camera so you can kind of get an overview of everything I'm doing rather than me trying to move it place to place. I just don't know that I have a spot so I may need him to build me like a little shelf that I can set stuff on. But all the girls are in one spot. I do have one boy over there still because he separated himself off so I just left him um, and then I've got the three boys over here so I'm gonna go ahead and run them all out first good boys good boys come on Nimbus come on boys Dogs, push. Uh, hello. Push, push, push. 
Good boy, good girl. That'll do. Good girl. That'll do. Here. Cool thing is, they pretty much put themselves back. It's not like the flock that kind of needs some encouragement to move. Come on, boys. No, don't be dumb now. You're so close to home. June, push, push, push. Push, push, push. Push, push, push. Good girl, push, push, push. Come on, boys. Good boys. That'll do. Here. Good girl, good boy. Okay, boys are in. Let's go grab the girls and send them out. Hope they go just as smoothly as these guys did. Yeah. Okay, come on girls. Put you on some fresh grass. No, really. Come on. There you go. That'll do. That'll. Hey! Here, here, pay attention. She usually doesn't chase to chase, but he does. And he tends to lose his brain every now and then. She's actually pretty good about just following behind him without really chasing them. Oh yeah, they're more than ready to head out. Did not need any encouragement from me at all. Okay, let's shut the gates and I think I need to water these lambs and then take hay up to the lambs at the house. Ooh, ouch. So yeah, these four are still playing grab ass down here. Oh, that hurts. And the rest of the boys are all up here in the trees trying to figure out, oh, here they come, what these idiots are doing. Well, hey, sis. Guys, look at how good that is. Oh, it's starting to get red again. She does have some flies on it, but I cannot get over, you know, all this new growth on there. Need to get her a little more fly spray and keep the bugs off of her. I am going to run out back and double check, make sure that gate is shut. Uh, I didn't get out there yesterday to check things. So I'm going to do it today. I just took hay to the lambs up at the house, fed them, and once I go and check the sheep out back, it'll be time for lunch for me.
Oh, there's another lamb. So it looks like there are just two out here. Oh no, yeah, lots of you. So just the two lambs left out here. Uh, and they're both boys, so we'll probably just leave them and they'll be the two we eat this year. Okay, let's go check that gate. Okay, so the gate is open. However, my neighbors are bike riding right now along the canal, so, so we're going to um, leave it for now and then come back and check it and make sure that they shut it on their way back whenever they get done. So probably after lunch, I'll come back out here and double check. It's quite a bit of green coming still. So down in these patches here, still greening up pretty good. And then there's also spots on this trail down here that are really green. And then of course under the trees, it's always, there's lots of green there. So they really do have quite a bit to eat still. So they should not be wandering. You ready to go back? Or are you just ready to hit the pond? Starting to rain. So if they, if it actually rains, as much as they say it's supposed to this afternoon, I won't be cutting that other field till next week. And I really kind of wanted to open it up tomorrow and have it done by the weekend. But I'd really prefer it not to rain because that other field is cut and it really needs the time to dry. I don't need the extra rain on it. So, uh, if this little sprinkle that we're getting is all we get, I'll be okay with that. I just hope it doesn't downpour like they're saying it's supposed to. Hey, Dad. Look a little wet, buddy. You ready to come in? Ooh. What do you think? We go dry you off a bit. Choose some lettuce. 